Right, so I thought I'd just quickly show you uh, what's happening on my course page on Udemy. And uh, so I've got 21 courses now that um, I've created and which uh, I've had over 15,000 students go through. And uh, it's been a fantastic uh, Cyber Week and Black Friday. So I thought I'd just jump into one of these courses very quickly. And uh, let's just go and have a look at uh, finish your research proposal and uh, get that study finished. That will get that milestone finished um in your degree absolutely important aspect of what you need to do so um very important that uh you go through uh this course and have a look at what's available in there and uh what i do provide is a lot of information um there's a q a section that you can go into and you can find out about what other students are doing um, and i get people to just introduce themselves and tell them what they're doing um, and then, uh, yeah, you'll get all the announcements, you know, um, information about other courses, etc. And um, yeah, so in terms of what you get in the course, um, there's obviously an introduction that you can go through, and where I really take you through everything, you know, about the course. Um, then, what a lot of my students find very, um, you know, useful is uh, this whiteboard uh, lesson that I take you through. Uh, where I clearly explain the three things that you need um, in your proposal. Um, and students absolutely love these uh, whiteboard um, lessons because it gives them everything that they need to know about the course as a bit of an overview. And then they can go into, you know, and in this case, there's three key things in your proposal um, that need to be there. And, uh, you know, this whiteboard lesson then really gives you that overview. And then I explain the relationship between all these different things and what needs to go uh, into your um, proposal. And then, of course, there's uh, quizzes um, in all my courses. Um, so here I've done the, the quiz. Um, and uh, once you go into it, uh, you'll be able to start the quiz. So, for example, explain what you're doing in your research, problem statement, key concepts. I give you a chance to practice the things that you learn. Um, in the course. So you go in there and you know it's multiple choice. So which answer best describes the key elements of your proposal that relate to what your research is all about? Um, so let's say we think that's the introduction, the problem statement, etc. Let's check the answer. Great. Yes. Good job. Uh, and you can go on to um, the next quiz. And all the way through, um, you need to, for example, explain you know why you're doing your research. That's very important in your proposal. And then I give you a quiz about that. Um, so that you can test again once you know once you've been through that what you've learned um, then you know how you're going to do your research um, very important that you describe you know how you know how that study is going to be carried out and the methodology that you're going to be using and uh, really take you through a lot of a lot of information there to give you the confidence um, to start doing your uh, proposal and then once again another quiz of course and um, you know I sort of end off with you know the presentation that you're going to have to do of your um, proposal and I really take you through you know the the, the nuts and bolts of doing um, a presentation I teach you a little bit about PowerPoint presentations uh, take you through um, you know give you for example why Amazon doesn't use PowerPoint uh, lots of interesting things there um, presentations not a murder mystery and same with your proposal tell people up front what you're going to tell them before you tell them and then tell them again what you told them etc um, I also even take you through some bad examples um, on the internet uh, that I found of just bad slides so that you can learn to avoid those uh, in your presentation when you do your proposal etc and um, and then actually give you assignment at the end so how to approach your research proposal presentation and proactively make uh, progress so there's um, assignment instructions that you can go through the submission uh, there's an instructor example and then you've got an opportunity uh, to give feedback so all in all that's just a quick insight into the course called uh, finish your research proposal and uh, get your study approved